The latest round of polling data out today shows that Hillary Clinton got a huge convention bounce from last week, and she's now leading Donald Trump by eight points nationally. So Donald Trump foreseeing a huge defeat in November has already started with the excuses for his concession speech. And uh, uh, today he is out there saying that he is afraid that this election is going to be rigged. Here's the sad thing. He's actually quite right. The election is going to be rigged to some extent, but it's going to be rigged in favor of Republicans because that's what they do best. Think back in 2000, 2004, 2008, 2012, when we had irregularities with voting machines, with people being purged from voting rolls, with repressive voter ID laws, who benefited from all of those things? It wasn't the Democrats, it was the Republicans. So even with all their experience and knowledge in stealing elections and, and, and all of that, Donald Trump still will not win. So he's going to go on this excuse tour prematurely, probably so that people understand when he loses, he totally called it. He knew it was going to happen. He's the greatest person that ever lived. And that's what we're going to hear more of. As we get closer and closer to November, the excuses are going to get much more wild than just fearing that the election's going to be rigged. He's going to go full blown conspiracy theorist. We'll probably hear things about uh, dead people casting ballots. But that's because Donald Trump can't accept the truth. And the truth is the American voters really don't want anything to do with him.